Hello everyone, I'm Mr. Mocha Lover, and thank you for rejoining me here in Old World Blues playing as that Federalist Reclamation Authority. So last time we had a good time against the banditos down here and going into Mexico and having a good time in installing Fisto, our <clears throat> Cerulean Robotics uh, leader, we'll say. And right now, I've just played a little bit, just a tiny bit off screen in which we are now trying to beat up the Western Brotherhood as, well, the second second Mexican Empire wants to go to war with us. But for some reason, they don't have enough political power right now. So, until they do, we're gonna be okay. And I think we'll probably do okay against the Western Brotherhood as well. Hopefully, hopefully, we can be prepared for the second second Mexican Empire. Right now, we're gonna get more attack jet planes. So I'm really hoping we can make a lot of combat robots very quickly. Very, 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 very quickly. In the meantime, we can make some more uh, support robots. It's fine. It's good. Actually, do we have anything else around here? Uh, military cars? Nah, we don't use those yet. <clears throat> oh, they broke our ciphers. Did we have a cipher against them? Yeah, we did. Should have used that. Should have used that earlier. That's okay. Cool. Nice. Keep going, guys. It's. Looking a little laggy, but that's okay. We don't mind a little bit of lag as long as we can win, right? Very nice. Ah, uh, and the Lost Hills Bunker falling down. So, uh, one of the comments from yesterday was that play as a Sky Reaver someday, or they should have some sort of unique focus tree. Maybe we can get the Zeton aliens. That'd be kind of cool. I will play as them someday. Both the Sky Reavers as well as the aliens. So, today's, today's not that day, but in time. In time, my friends. I definitely will. Oh, boy. Oh boy. Just go to 24. Please. Go. 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 <laughs> oh. Yep. And we should have them pretty soon, actually. We got some sauce. We can make some APCs. We can make some tanks. That'd be good. Oh, yeah. Look at that combat robot percentage. Oof. How is everything else looking? Oh, yeah. We're out to war at war with the she. And we're doing pretty well. We're doing pretty darn well. Ace by the promoted. Very good. Here, not really. Cool. Nice. Now we have four armies of full stacked robots. Which is awesome. I'm gonna request you guys come down here and help out. And I'm gonna request that you guys come over here. Help out as well, because they're not doing anything, are they? Ah they're not on extreme attacks. Go ahead, guys. Never mind. Yeah, there goes the cheat chapter. Go ahead, hold up, hold on then. Wait for everyone else. Since we're trying to come through here too. Can you guys just break through here? Yeah, you might be able to. Another robot. Beautiful. Additional support is gone. They must have a lot of air force. A lot of air force. A big air force, because we keep getting you know these things that say stuff about shooting other people down. I'm sorry. I'm I'm working very slow but when I'm recording this, apparently, mentally. <laughs> I'm very slow right now. Holy cow. Who dares wins? Very good. Oh, nice. Now everyone come together and beat up the enemies. Good. Yeah. Hopefully the conquering the... Oh, that, that's nice. That's very, very nice. We can get some more materials going. Yeah, I'm just gonna put you at the top. I need you for everything, pretty much. Hopefully, we'll get some more resources. Thing over here. Oh, yep. Yeah. Uh, proving ground and Yuma, sure. Exploit them. Now we good. Improve screws. I like the screws. Good. More robots. Ah, and there they go. Not really, not too difficult to do. Actually, it's a little bit easier than I thought, just because the Western Brother usually has a pretty good amount of uh, power armor. Can I go to war with anyone else before these guys would come kill us, maybe? I mean, they got a ton of divisions. We could hold them there, we could probably hold them there, we could probably hold them there as well. But, hmm. Mm hmm. Would we have time to go to war with these guys? 90 days. 
How strong are these guys? 3,000 manpower. That's kind of risking it. That's definitely kind of risking it. There's so many waterways we have to guard, though. Oh, I don't like this. I really don't like this. This main line is going to get smashed to heck and back. Oof. So, we're going to do that. This is probably one of the few times I actually build up forts around here. Okay, so here's what we're going to do. One, two, three, four. Right there. Uh, not right there, actually. Because that's a different nation. So that's good. One, two, three. There you go. Do we need to do that one? No, not, no, not that one either. Good. Five, six. We'll do six here. Two, three, four. Um, two, three, four, five. Good. And then another four right there. And then one, two, three. Ooh. Hopefully we have enough. Whoopsie. Good. Hmm, yeah, we could do that, but I'm gonna wait. Uh, we'll throw on the saws, too. Good. So we got that, we got that. Over here. Yeah. That's what's gonna have to happen. Good. I'll let you three come here first. Getting a little crazy first. And then you guys will come over here, split you guys up in half. Come right there. That'll be good. So then when we make more divisions... Ooh, dynamite, nice. They can come over here and start guarding other areas. That being said, let's go ahead and grab anti-tank rifles, because we can. And then build up a poop ton of these things. Nice. Cool. Because they have a butt-ton of robots. So many robots. So many divisions. We should be able to build this stuff up fairly quickly, though. Shouldn't be too bad trying to build it up, but you never know. Um, I cannot press enter for some reason. Okay, well, whatever. I know time is going on. Okay, game, I don't know why I can press enter, but that's a little concerning. Uh, better robots? No, we're pretty much done getting better robots. Scrap gun trucks? Sure, why not? Don't want to forget radar. Well, we got the radar already. Nice. Get some more planes around here, maybe. Because we definitely going to need them. Uh, cool. Good. And actually, I'm going to throw you right here. Nice. There we go. So are they justifying on us yet? I don't know. I have a cup of coffee here. Not yet. Not yet. I'm really not sure what they're doing. If it's taking this long for them to go to war with us. Because they have a lot of divisions. Holy cow. Five forces. So it's about 20 combat with robot divisions. And they have APCs. They do have anti-tank, which is not good. Hmm. More divisions? Good. Good. Spread them out, spread them out. Any other planes we might be able to throw on? We really don't have a lot of fighters. <laughs> That's not good. Yep, but we made enough for 100. That's good. Alright, nice. There you guys right there. Light machine guns, cool. Anything else around here? Maintenance is looking good. <clears throat> Excuse me. Mm hmm. We could use more war support, though. Hmm. Don't like that. Don't like how low that is. Shrapnel shell. Cool. Yeah, two divisions per tile on defense. Not great. Cool. Ball attrition. It's up, but we are building up forts like crazy, and that's, which is actually kind of going okay right now. Especially if we have construction engineering on. Since that will give us... Oh, it could suppress subjects. Faster land for construction speed by 20%, outpost as well by another flat 20%, which is kind of nice. Alright, are you guys ready yet? I might just go to war with them myself then. No? Uh, how long would it take for us to go to war with these guys then? Just to get it over with. Give me five days. Well, we still have to wait a little bit first. 
over here. Oh, yeah. So what are we lacking besides combat robots? We're actually doing really well in this now. Mm, close air support. Definitely we need some more close air support. Definitely need some more of this, but we're already trading away stuff from our puppet, which I don't like. Since they could raise their autonomy a little bit more. So, have an airbase. How about you have two airbases? And where can we core more stuff? We're kind of heading up this way last time. Um, suicide runs, cool. Oh, that's not bad. Let's support this one. Might as well. Might as well. Healing powder. Cool. Clamp down on autonomy. You might as well, since we're getting so many resources from our puppets. Uh, are we gonna go to war with this yet? Yes! Oh god, five days. Five days, guys. Five days. This is gonna be so bad. We almost have a surplus. Just in time for us to get hit really harshly here. Come on, keep building, guys. Keep building. Mora. Wheel breakers. Gallop. Oh boy. Oh boy. Any other things we can throw on? Maybe a few more planes here and there, maybe? I don't know. Uh, throw them. Still over here. That's fine. Come on, get up to 100. Should be able to. No? Okay, cool. Alright, so they can go to war with us any day now. Never mind. Oh boy. Oh boy, we're actually kind of holding though. We're actually kind of holding. That is a little surprising. Okay, I was not expecting that we were actually going to hold that well so far. Well, in some areas we are, some areas we're not. Hmm. Please don't overrun us. Losses, 400. Call you, call them in. You know what? What if we just try to attack? Some areas we're going to do well. Some areas we're definitely not. Over here, we're definitely going to suffer a lot. Oh, robot on robot action. We are going to lose quite a few robots doing this, I know. Hey, we're actually pushing through here, which is kind of surprising as well. I kind of like it. Over here, well, this is definitely not very good. <clears throat> they lost 11,000, but that's like nothing to them right now. That's like nothing. I mean, to us, it doesn't mean much either, but they definitely have more divisions than us. So we gotta be careful. Uh, losses? Not too bad so far, actually. Another division? Cool. Throw them over here. Can we cut these guys off? That would be very nice. Get rid of that. So you, can move, you guys can move in. As long as we have air superiority for a while, it's probably the most important thing. Probably. About 17,000. We have 340 divisions. Anyone have upgraded so far? Because this is. Maybe. Maybe. That's very good. Grab that one. In here. Oh, yeah. 707 is a field marshal, but whatever. Here. Nice. So you're right there too. So far, so good. Not too bad for us. Nuclear powered attack planes, cool. Do we have enough radar around here? We might not. We we'll do that as well. Cool. Anything else that we can do? Yes. Get better saws. We can get better robots later on. We'll do that first. Scrap gun trucks would be nice, but they also require circuitry, which is not very nice. <laughs> which is very, very not nice. Keep going, guys. You're doing great. <clears throat> we just killed another division off. Good. It's going surprisingly easier than I thought. Oh, yeah, we've been winning down here, too. Well, we killed off 15 divisions so far. Uh, I'm sure they have a massive stockpile of stuff, though. And actually, if we can capture enemy's equipment... <clears throat> excuse me, we can get more robots back, which is actually really helpful. Incredibly helpful, actually. Uh, Air-wise, yeah, we're doing overall pretty darn nicely in all these locations, which is exactly what I was hoping for. Even though we're still not winning, like, overwhelmingly winning right now. Still. So, 
Let's see what happens. Refined mixture is cool. Oh, that's not good. We might be able to win with APCs. Can we pierce each other? No, we can't pierce each other at all. Yes, I'll take gliders. Oh, that's not good. We're already out of fighters. That's not good at all. Cool. Oh boy, did we get in circle here? Come on, man. Oh, we did not. Good. <clears throat> Very good. Oh, we lost four divisions already. Yep, 2,000 losses, 43,000 losses. Not bad, not bad. You guys can just cut these divisions out of the way. Cut them out. That would be very beneficial. Let's get rid of them so we don't have to guard that area. Crazy horse. Um. <clears throat> Excuse me. I do have coffee, coffee here too. To Give us nice and warm. Cool. They're spreading through here very quickly, but then again, we are coming through here. Cut them off. Oh, we can use a cypher. Thank God I was doing that. I did not realize I was doing that either. Good. Oh, that should def. Oh, yeah, look at that. More green. We still have some red, but more green now. Mm. This is going a lot better than I thought. You know, when they say they were through over 300 divisions, I'm starting to get a little worried there, man. You know, I'm starting to get a little worried. Now it's looking like we can actually do this. We haven't taken that many losses versus 61,000. We've already killed over 100 divisions. That is pretty good. Even though we don't really don't need this anymore, we're almost done building all the stuff up. So we always have a base to retreat to if, we, if needed, maybe? Good, good, good. Beautiful. Exploration, cool. Uh, how's our navy doing, actually? We don't have that many ships, that's okay. Not to me, repairs. I'm doing a lot better on combat robots. Holy cow. <clears throat> yeah, we need to definitely reorganize this. But once we can push further down from the north, we'll be okay. 84,000 losses, not enough, not enough. Never enough. Nuclear jet fighters, cool. Jet gun trucks, and that. Cool. Nuclear jet fighters, we might as well upgrade them. Not bad. Max it out. Can we throw in anything else like better range? Weapons? No. There you go. We're gonna make some extremely good jet fighters. Very nice jet fighters. Some of the best jet fighters that we have. Hmm. I could make more armies, but at this point, after making this many, I think we're gonna hang out. And we can stay with six. We might lose a few more divisions here and there, but yeah, we'll just wait first. You guys come down here. Help out. We've lost 4,000, probably 5,000. Over 100,000 have been lost. Almost killed half of the entire army of the Second Second Mexican Empire, which is beautiful. 503, yes. Desert Fox. Desert Fox Arena. At this point, I'm feeling confident that we can change to... Uh, which one do we want? This one has a lower production cost and actually doesn't even require circuitry. Why am I waiting this long to do this? 1821 and 35 armor. So it's... 13 and a half, 18. 50 armor. Oh, this is, has even more armor. Uh, this is hard production cost, but has more armor. Has less breakthrough, which I do not like. 60% hardness. 70% hardness. 47% 47 soft attack. Says, hmm. Mm hmm. We are using iBots. Let's give it a 16 armor. Well, the speed is 8. Is the speed different for either one of these two? 5 and probably 5, right? Now this is 4. It would make more sense for us to do Rocco Brain. But I want more armor. Uh, we'll just do this one. It doesn't really matter. 
Cool. Oh, now we need other resources. Oh, that's not good. Thank you. I'll trade you for that stuff. Thank you. I'll trade you for that stuff. And we're good. Perfect. Oh, do we have some of this? Assault craft, loading fortress. There you go. Cool. And we go to the hub. Not a hub, but the hub. Cool, cool, cool. Awesome. Now we should be making a ton of ships. Tons and tons and tons and tons and tons and tons of ships. Now I think the Mexican army is kind of beat. We've killed so many. So many, man. We now have more factories than them. We now have more... No, they still have more divisions than us. Cool. Oh, you guys are done. Well, not really. You're, not, you're never going to be done with me. All this we have to conquer. And that's a good thing. That's a very good thing. After this, we'll just finish off Mexico. Costa Cafenada. Finish these guys off as well. Finish these guys off. Finish these guys off. I don't know why they went to war with me first before finishing off all of Mexico. It doesn't really make that much sense, but you know what? Whatever. If we make another division, I'm just going to take this area out. We actually don't have that many, um, that much army XP. Oh, they definitely have someone here. That is not bueno. We need some biggies as well. Come on, guys. Hurry up. Go, 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 go. This is still quite disgusting, though. All these waterways, all these holes. Ooh, did you guys get encircled? Come on, man. That's not cool. Don't die down there. Wartime administration. Reaffirm our control. That'd be good. Come on. Get over here. Adaptive carpet mentalization. Good. Cool, and we'll fix it up very soon. Who are you part of? This group. Yeah, I'm going to tell you guys to come this way. And clean this up. That'll be good. Yep, get in there, get in there. We can rescue these guys. Good, get, some, get them some supplies. Boom, supplies are in. Losses, they have roughly 100 divisions left. And that's a great thing. Uh, help settlements, that'd be nice. A, nah. Research speed, sure. Why not? Oh, we have someone else who's done here. Nice. Uh, since you're up here, they, have, they definitely have someone over here, too. Do that. I might just throw them against someone else, like... Malaya. Maybe. We'll see what happens. Oh, they actually made another division. Wow. Good for you. Slacker's done. Focus fire. We could do some research, which we will soon enough. Oops. Wrong one. There we go. Have some more coffee. Yeah, we probably don't need it. Great. Uh, we can always make more later, that's fine. I will make these guys bigger. Cool. Very nice, very nice. Looking okay-ish. This is looking disgusting still, but that's okay. As we're continually pounding the enemies down. <sighs> they don't even have, have less than 100 divisions yet. Come on, man. Are you really even trying? Let everyone come this way. Please? Wait, why can't I move you? Okay, they're glitched or something. Hmm. 
Oh, now you can move? That was weird. That was very weird. I could not move them. What the heck? Oh, well. At least it's done. I think we're going to war these guys, but now we're going to wait. Alright, so you guys. Uh, We'll keep focusing going down south. Keep doing that. That would be great. You guys do that. You guys come there, too. Actually, just go straight there. Ooh. And we still get 1.39 a day. That's not bad. War support actually went up, which is good. Because, while well, we're defending. Oh, they're coming this way. That's not good. That's disgusting. Very disgusting. Getting invaded in South Chihuahua. Huh. Oh, you guys are... Wow, that is ballsy. That is kind of ballsy. Alright, so... Oh, they're more than halfway done capitulating, which is good. These guys should be able to wrap them up pretty quickly, though. Should is a good word. Wee. Nice. Go right on ahead. Good. Oh, and they're dead. Now they have finally less than 100 divisions, which we should capitulate them very soon since we're very close to Monterey. We have already taken La Lux Lair? No. It's... Actually, we technically already did. But so that's good. That's very good. Just kill them off. Ah, Wild Bill Hickok, yes. Alright, so since, since we're here, let's go ahead and start justifying on this group. Oh god, their resistance is incredibly high. Ridiculously high. Please get a Monterey. Nice. After this war, I expect that we're going to have a ton of spare robots just lying around. Just for support. The guy was wounded. They should capitulate soon. They're very close. Incredibly close. La Pesca. Nice. We're going to strip for La Pesca. They won't last that much longer. Strategic destruction. Cool. Wow, look at that. We actually have an extra 14,000 spare combat robots right now. That's probably the first time in this campaign where we actually have a surplus of combat robots. Which I'm about to ruin, probably. Well, actually, with 14,000, that's, that's still quite a bit. Palo Verde NGS? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh no. We did it, my friends. We have done it. Now this is beautiful. Thank you, Maximilian. Casually have over half a million manpower now. Alright. Very nice. I'll let you guys do over that right there. You guys come right there. You guys come over there. At this point, I can't really be bothered to make really good lines, you know. You guys come over there, too. I have a good feeling they really can't do very much against us, though. Which is good. Uh, we're going to take out Pecos Colony, too. Which might be a little bit more challenging, but... I can't imagine it be exceedingly challenging. Cool. Cancel the lease. Yeah, whatever. We're going to make a lot of this. Can we make gun trucks? No, we cannot yet. We don't have that researched yet. Um, yeah, definitely get more nuclear jet fighters. Definitely more of this, though, too. Cool. Costa Caffinata, you might as well do that one. Yeah, that'd be good. Operational distribute pit boys, yes. Are we good to go? Yes, we are, senors. Oh, it's actually a war with someone else. Oh, no one cares. Are we just fine these guys? Oh, Pickles calling you first, that's fine. Oh, that's fine, that's fine. Yeah, we may get a scrap gun truck, that's kinda nice. Yes, very good. Oops, I paused it by accident. Why sign APC is good. Nice. Great stuff. Alright, all you guys just head on down here. Really doesn't matter, even though I know supplies were so bad. Probably he oh my god, that's you know what, before we go too far. Um, eradicate him. Oh no, right here. Yeah, that's an extreme amount of resistance. 
we might lose a few divisions, which is fine. I can always make divisions pretty quickly. We have so many robots, not even funny right now. And we got in support, whatever. Come on, I left click to right click. Good. Oh wait, we can use this too. If we really want to, it really doesn't matter. Come on, take them out so we don't lose that many robots. Come on, go, 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 go. Oh, why did the AI take it? God dang it. I'm just gonna take everything anyways, it, it really doesn't matter. Yeah, I gotta keep it on robots. Oh, Wild Bill? You got anything for us? Nerd Rage? Sure, why not? Sure, oh, why not, though? So. Yeah, look at this. Resistance, 100%. My gosh, that is insane. Please, take it so we can get out of here. Come on, take it, 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 take it. Okay, we got it. Whew. Thank God. I'm not gonna give anything to the, po that, the people down there. I'm not gonna let them just ruin resistance and stuff like that. Cool. Let's move up here quickly, if we can. And deal with the resistance later on. Come over here. I would like to finish up Mexico by the end of this episode, but we'll, we'll see what happens. Cool. They are probably gonna flood through here. I hate I hate all these waterways. They really need to get rid of some of these. I'm just not interested in waterways at all. I don't think anyone is. Don't go on a little bit. Good war by September 23rd, which is good. Get out of there, get out of there. That'd be nice. Got a month left. Or we really need to go to war. Good, 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 good. So many places need infrastructure. What a shame. What a shame. Steel tech? Cool. I mean, at this point, I don't think we really need to. I mean, we're already advanced. I wonder, can you steal tech? If you're like an uncivilized or tribal nation, can you actually steal tech and, uh, from advanced nations? Because that would actually be kind of cool. I never thought about that. Uh, are we there yet, guys? Come on. Oh my gosh. Alright, that's the case, everyone. Strategic redeploy. Go, 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 get out of here. Oh, uh, you know what, just in case then. We'll re-justify on this. 105. Actually, well, these guys done before then. Whatever. Well, maybe not. Actually, we will, yeah. We actually will. Uh, that's fine then. Do we have any resistance here? Not that much. Let's go and rearrange this then. You guys come down here. You guys come down here. Let's put you guys in half. Yeah, we might not be able to get to finish all of Mexico in this episode. It's kind of a shame. You guys come down here-ish. Good. You guys come over here. Come down here. Or the other half of you come over here. And we eradicate these people. <clears throat> With, of course, much love. Much, much love. Aerial refueling, good idea. We need that one because we can. <clears throat> Excuse me. Excuse me. Oh, yeah, look at that. There's, that's so bad for manpower. Oh, my goodness. That is incredibly poor. Hmm. Yeah. I, would, I, I don't know. I mean, there's still room for improvement for the AI. <clears throat> I mean, I love the developers, what they do with Old World Blues. But sometimes, I don't know, maybe they can improve the AI just so that they know when to do resistance eradication. I'm not exactly sure. I think they still use caravan guards when uh, they take other territory and they just kind of let it sit there. But I'm really thinking that maybe the AI should like be or know when to use different 
territorial management ideas. Because right now, I mean, they're looking so weak. Incredibly weak. I could just probably, you know, blow some wind at them or something and they just fall over and die. I mean, just... I don't know. Maybe that could be an improvement. Maybe that'll come along later on. Who knows? We'll see what happens. The devs are very, very, very good. So... We'll see what happens. Cool. We'll need some APCs. We could make some tanks right now, but do we really want to? Actually, probably. Tank divisions, yeah. Uh, APCs, there you go. APCs, cool. 28 combat width. If I threw this on there, that would throw everything out of whack, so. Thank you. Thank you. 40 combat width. Too bad we can't make 80 combat width. That'd be a lot of fun. Demo teams. You might as well throw demo teams on there. Maintenance, absolutely. Don't need chem companies. Dogs? Probably not. Probably not dogs. Fire teams. Yeah, I guess the fire teams. I almost never use fire teams. And then chems? That does lower the armor by quite a bit. Eh, actually, dogs do better. Uh, they already have 37 piercing, which is actually really good. Look at some dogs. Why not? I love dogs. I don't have any dogs. Look at some dogs, anyways. Good. You can train one tank division at a time. That's fine. Oh, it's not bad. There you go. Right there. Biggies. Ah, good. Let's go ahead, take them out, put them out of the misery. There we go. Yeah. Even fighting over the river. We're not even at the border yet, for some of us. Holy cow, that's, you know, that's bad. Alright, so it looks like we can probably pacify the area now. Pacification? Oh, you're still pacifying it. Yeah, it's fine. It's whatever. Combat blimps? Cool. Solar ships? Cool. Nope. I could upgrade our ships too. Actually, sh speaking of ships, got a couple more. Good, very nice. Oh, they're actually spreading through here. Oh, it's because we don't have any guys down here. Duh. Why don't you guys get over here? Capitals right in the center. Oh my God! Look at all the resistance here. Really not too worried about it though. Hmm. Nah, the eradication's going down, which is finally good. We can go and do this because resistance will still go down as we're doing this. Oh, let's go back up. Hmm. Slowly going up, but that's just because we need more uh, compliance. That's all we need. Pecos Colony, I guess we do you next. We'll do them next, why not? Yes, even if we lose divisions here, I'm not, I'm not really too worried about it. There's the guys, can you can you move? Can you please move? I mean, I know supplies and really bueno around here, but come on, man. Come on. Cool, that's good. First solar stockpiles, cool. All y'all come down here. Good. And just get in there, please. Good. They should die. Good. Let's get the heck out of here, because it sucks. Because it really sucky down here. Alright. Put it up here. Good. Oh, we're going to war them immediately. That's nice. Alarming trend. Do that one. There you go. Half you guys get over here. Cool. Another half come right there as well, I guess. As long as we can push over the river, it really doesn't matter too much. But that's only if. Cool. And then you guys come over here. Do it again in half. These guys are all taken care of. And then you guys come over here. Yep. And we go to war probably by February. And I'm going to make everyone move fast. Go, go, go. Yep, go to war by February 18th. Not bad. Yeah, I definitely will not be able to uh, finish Mexico in this episode, probably. Chichen Itza is still pretty big down there. Uh, even more. Oh, more ships. Cool. Floating fortresses. Even though we could upgrade them even further, I don't really care at this point. I'm still researching stuff that we could upgrade them with, but nah. The AI so far really doesn't care about upgrades, so why should I, right? To a point, to a certain point. Okay, let's move, 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 just in case, because this they took a while down here. Ah, oh, it's looking better. Definitely looking better. You guys, oh my god, that's still so much resistance. Ugh, disgusting. Absolutely disgusting. Put you guys on high. You guys are medium, actually. Cool. Now, yeah, do we have enough... Hmm. 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 Radar? 
before I forget about that, throw some radar down here too, and throw lots of infrastructure, because this place is going to suck to attack. It's going to be real sucky. Real sucky hours here. Which sounds really bad out of context. So, to some degree, you know. Real sucky hour. What is that? Oh god. Oh no, we're out of combat robots again. Are you kidding me, man? Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Well, we're making 35 a day, so that's not too bad. Uh, we go to war by... 18th. Cool. We go to war by the 18th. I'm not too worried about that then. Give us a little bit of time just to heal up. Repair a couple things. Enjoy ourselves. Clamp down an autonomy. Yes, please. Anything else around here, maybe? Coring worthless land? Now that's what I'm all about. Thank you. Alright, now, so we're minus 5,000. Every few days. We get another 100 made. Nice. Go, just go ahead. We should do okay. Especially if we had time to make some robots. Oh, over here. Yeah, that's nice. Under MacArthur, I'm not really worried at all. Oh, 707. Can you, yep, yep, that's good. That's good. That's some good stuff. Cool. Very nice. Yep, we're doing great. Just as I predicted. Who knows, we might not even use the Navy in this campaign at all. In most campaigns, I almost never use it. The only reason why you use or make a Navy, for the most part, is to take out New Victoria, which is on Vancouver Island in Canada. Which is sometimes not even necessary. Sometimes you can just navally invade because people take New Victoria out, which is always very nice. Hold on, before you win, 314 losses versus 15,000. Eh, we've had better. better. Better better, casualty rates. You know, I always say that just because, like, in early games, you can do exceedingly well. Like, in this campaign, we've won wars where we've killed thousands of enemies when we've uh, lost, like, nobody. Literally nobody. So, <laughs> it's always kind of fun saying that. It's like, oh, look how good I am. But not really. Not really that good. You just got to know sometimes how the AI does stuff. Because AI, it's, it's the AI. It's AI. Cool, you guys come down here. That, thank you. Now, Chichen Itza might be incredibly difficult. It could be. It doesn't look like it, though. They don't have that many divisions, it appears. Cool. Did I even start justifying on these guys yet? No, I haven't. Oh. Well, I just... That's not good. We do have our breakthrough ability against them. We'll do that one next. Just go and do these guys. Yeah, that'd be nice. There you go. It's going to take a long time for those guys, but that's okay with me because we can help some settlements out. We can investigate rumors, but we'll do that later. Let's scavenge a couple things with that. Weekly war support. We lower our stability. Mm, not really interested in that at all. And as we're waiting, let's go ahead and build up a few more things here. We could end the episode, but I'm going to say, no, nah, I want to get to war first before we end the episode. And we need to check out how strong the chicken pizza, chicken pizza is. That'd be very good. Very, very good. Cool. Nuclear cartilage? Sounds kind of bony. Bony. Nosy. Got a lot of cartilage in your nose. Cool, cool, cool. Well, at least we're in late game now. 22.89. Actually, when you guys play Old World Blues, for those of you who are watching, how late do you usually run your campaigns? Because I know that a lot of people... They don't play usually this late. I'm weird where I play like until like almost the year 3000, maybe. I play very late in the campaigns. I play very, very late sometimes. Not always, but usually. So a lot of people, they end their campaign sometimes in the first five years. Of course, most people probably aren't doing full waste on conquests. But let me know in the comments below, like how long do you play your campaigns? By what year do you think you think you play your campaigns, because I'm a little weird with my campaigns. I love playing until we have a very good goal finished. Probably. Probably. Sometimes. Not always. Sometimes. And the reason why this is a full Wasteland campaign is just because if I'm trying to re reunite all of America under one banner, you pretty much have to play until you have a full Wasteland campaign done. Cool. Flying armor. Cool. So, flying fortress that I'll never use. Yeah, you know what? Speaking of flying fortresses, I have used airships before. I used them when I played as Costa Cafenada. If you haven't checked that campaign out, it was actually kind of interesting. Playing as a puppeted nation, which I never start off as. But using flying fortresses, their cost to produce, or just anything like combat bombs, is so high. And they get shot down so quickly by enemy AI, enemy divisions, that it, I've never found them to be particularly useful. 
It's so much cheaper just to make fighters, close air support, even tactical bombers. I'm hoping that someday that uh, the devs address that. I'm sure they will. I'm sure they will. But flying fortresses really kind of need a little bit more attention, we'll say. A little more attention, just because the cost to produce them compared to the effectiveness really isn't quite there yet. But, you know, I know the devs will get there eventually. Scavengers Triumph, hey, cool, nice. A bonus for naval tech? Well, we're actually using naval tech, I think. So that's really good. Good. Got some more planes. Good. Let's go ahead and go to war. Oh, God, they they have... Oh, no. Oh, wait, hold... Wait. Hold on. This is Costa... I just realized this is Costa Caffinata. Um... What happened to Chichen Itza? What? Okay. Okay. I was definitely not expecting... No wonder they'd have no manpower. Oh, God, the resistance is going to be sky high. Oh, no. They actually have a lot of manpower. They have a lot of manpower. What, how do... Well, they have only 21 divisions? What happened in Mexico? You know, Old World Blues, Hearts of Iron 4, it always surprises you with, you know, different things that you don't expect. Always surprising me with different things. You never know what you might find in an Old World Blues campaign. You never know. And that's why it's pretty interesting. Regardless of campaign. Good. The hub. Let's go down to the hub. Very nice. Got a couple more ships. Not going to make you. The cost is just too high. Yeah, did you see that cost? Look at that. This is 150. 140. Over 1,000 for... Oh, it's about 1,000 for this one. That's insane. Yeah, I'm not really too worried about this. And I don't want my robot too damaged by bad supply and stuff like that. So you guys come up here. Flying fortresses, cool. Super fortress, great. I love to research them. Never gonna use them. That'd be good. That'd be good. Good, good, good. and that'd be awesome. 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 Uh, yes. Naval weapons station Seal Beach. Good. 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 You guys go ahead when you can. Armor reinforcements. Let's go ahead and build up some infrastructure here because I know supplies gonna be so bad. Even though it really doesn't affect supply when the state itself is so god awful. That as well. Alright, so since we're here, let's find them first. Where is Costa? Blackfoot. Pacification. Eh, the resistance doesn't seem too bad for us to go to eradication just yet. It's, it's tolerable here. It's, it's still tolerable, which is okay. What? I might just kill these guys off before we end the episode. I might just honor my word and do that. Let's do that. Why not? A little longer episode, a little longer. That's okay. As long as you enjoy it, that's what really matters, right? Exactly. Oh, we might have a few tanks. Jolly good. Or a tank. Um, yep, a new guy. Unit 711. I like that. Bunker kid, though. I don't like bunker kid. Perceptive, agile, lucky. I love the police protectrons. Gunslinger, Idiot Savant, nice. Anything else up here? Um, Ninja seems like fun, but we don't really get a recon bonus, infantry attack. I'll do that one, why not? Okay, they're dead! Okay, that was a lot faster than I thought. I kept thinking this was Costa Caffinata. Or, Chichen Itza, I mean. It is Costa Caffinata. So, before we go end this campaign, or, not campaign, episode, you guys come up here too. Have a good time. You guys, come over here. Prepare for the old country. And then you guys prepare for this over here as well. Okay, then I know I could research stuff, but at this point, research really means nothing. Good. We're done here too. We're done here too. Are we done here? Nope, not yet. Even though we're not even gonna use that stuff, but that's okay. You guys just barely got up here in time. Do that. Get some air bases. Get some radar up here as well. Any infrastructure needed? Probably. 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 But not there. Oh, look at all this stuff we can build up. Cool. Nice. Uh, we should be able to go and do pretty darn well. So, oh, they're fighting New Victoria. That's fine. They want to attack us. Oh, the poor people here. The poor, poor people. Oh, well, they chose poorly. I'm, I'm actually surprised that this group has survived for this long. 
That almost never happens. I'll put you right there. Go and have a good time with whatever we can do. Bear packs too. Good. Yeah, we'll finish these guys up, and then we'll call it a campaign. Actually, that being says, Oopsie. Ask to join their faction? No, we good. We good. Because tomorrow's episode will be the last episode in this campaign because, well, we're running out of people to attack. <laughs> we are running out of people to attack. Uh, looks like not bad. 4,000. Oh, they lost 3,000 already? Wow. Now uh, we're going to need a navy to kill them off, too. Do we have a lot of people just... Why are our ships not doing great? What's going on here? Oh, they're all in... Oh. Have I been building it in a bad area? I might be. Uh, okay. Well, regardless, we just won, won the war. So, hope you enjoyed today's episode, guys. If you did, consider leaving a like. Subscribe if you're new. Check out my Discord link in the description below, and I'll see you all tomorrow when we shall finish this campaign off. Thanks for watching. Have a great rest of your day.